to do this sort of thing to unwitting people, I just think it's criminal. June Small says she can prove she's been ripped off. As I said, it's just criminal. It's lies and deceit. And they must be very desperate for money. Last Friday, June left her office at 11.47. Her dash cam recorded the exact time. The camera even records a conversation she has with her partner on the way. I just thought I'd ring you because I'm going to get my nails done. Nine minutes later at 11.58, June pulls into the car park. I went straight to the ticket machine, um, bought a ticket at 11.58 and that allows me two hours parking to 1.58. At 1.43, June gets back to her car reactivating the dash cam but she finds a nasty surprise. You can pay for a ticket and then you get booked. Oh, really? There was um, a fine on my windscreen for $88. I went over to the employee uh, that works for the company and I asked her, could she explain um, why I got a fine when I had an unexpired ticket? She told me that I had an expired ticket. She couldn't care less. <laughs> she just stood there and blatantly lied to me. Couldn't care less. Not in the least bit concerned. June says the attendant told her it was because she had an expired ticket on her dash. But the fine was issued at 12.39, less than an hour after she arrived. And that's what I kept saying to her. But show me, show me where this expired ticket is. Oh, you would have destroyed it and put this one in its place. <laughs> oh, come on, no, that's not, that's not correct. Yeah, so I did call her a liar. <laughs> How did she react? She didn't. <laughs>